Hello friends, in today's modern world, the majority of us, irrespective of our age and gender, have encountered with severe types of dermal conditions. So that's why I have decided to make the psoriasis eczema soap. For this reason, I have prepared a batch of 1 kg of oils, which is a blend of coconut oil, extra virgin olive oil and castor oil. In the end, I am going to super fat it with neem oil and black seeds oil. I have already prepared my lye solution. Uh, so I'm going to add it and stick blend it. So see you after the break. As you can see, my soap has been traced out. Initially, I have kept the heat on high and after some time I would turn it low until the soap is fully prepared. This is sulfur. Sulfur is a bright yellow natural mineral that has been used as a remedy for centuries. In ancient texts such as the Bible, it is called brimstone and 2000 years ago it was used as a remedy for skin disorders. Sulfur has many benefits for the skin. It is an antiseptic and antifungal. It treats dry, scaly, itchy and red skin. So that's why it's very useful to treat uh, eczema and psoriasis. It is naturally found in foods like egg yolk, onion, garlic and cabbage. Sulfur soap is highly recommended by the dermatologists to fight eczema and psoriasis. So I am going to use 70 grams of powdered sulfur uh, in my soap. I have reserved some water from lye solution to dissolve my powdered sulfur. This is FDA approved camphor. The Cinnamomum camphora tree is where camphor originates from. It is actually obtained by the distillation of the barks and the branches of, of the camphor tree. For generations, camphor has been used to treat many skin problems that cause itching like eczema and psoriasis. It helps to reduce inflammation of the skin and decrease the pain. My soap has been gelled fully and it's fully prepared. Now I'm going to turn off the heat and add the sulfur powder that I have dissolved in the reserved distilled water. So see you after the break. The sulfur powder has been mixed and now I am going to mix in my camphor powder. I am going to use 50 grams of camphor powder. Camphor powder has been mixed properly and now I am going to mold my soap. Unmolded my sulfur camphor soaps. I forgot to mention one thing that I have super fatted it with black seed oil and neem oil 20 grams each. I have formulated this recipe on the suggestion of my dear friend Afia Tayyab, who is herself a pharmacist. I am proud of you Afia. She advises to use this soap daily for the first week, thrice on the next week and then once in a week. I am sure my this video is going to be very helpful for lots of people out there suffering from these skin conditions. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and leave a like.